So thanks for joining us, everybody. I'm Ryan with Sports Stuff Hub. We're live streaming here on our Saturday edition of our box breaks and case breaks. And uh, we're going to start off here with a little box preview for you of 2016 Panini Classic Football. Uh, what this is, is a 14-pack box. You get 10 cards per pack. This is 2016 product. Uh, you only get one autographed card per pack, or, or excuse me, per box. Um, and then you also have an, uh, an opportunity to get uh, Canton Collection autographs. And also they did a buyback uh, autograph thing in here as well. And I'm not entirely sure how they're packaged, so I don't know if it's something that's on top or, or what. So, But uh, we're just going to jump into it here real quick and just run through it. Like I said, um, my wholesaler's got a bunch of these boxes sitting there, and uh, they're, they're looking to try to move them. Uh, I believe, like I said, they're around 45 to 50 bucks after shipping, so not too bad of a price, um, considering you're only getting one autograph anyways. Um, it's not my type of product, but anyway, uh, here's what the cards look like. So as I said, this is 2016 Panini Classic. It's the old Don Russ lo uh, look. Uh, so here you start off with a uh, Monday Night Heroes Odell Beckham insert. Not numbered. Rookie Jordan Payton, Warren Moon Legend, Raymond Berry Legend, and Bob Greasy Legend. So I'm going to fly through this a little bit unless I see something that uh, that looks interesting and worth noting. Barry Sanders, legend. Kenyon Drake. James Lofton, LaDainian Tomlinson, legend. Kurt Warner, legend. I've only gotten uh, a pack or two of this in the past, and it came in my loot lockers. Um, which, if you're unfamiliar with loot lockers, you'll have to go back onto my... Jeez, these are tough to open. Uh, go back into our videos that are posted on our YouTube channel. You can see what a loot locker is. Um, but we did... Uh, I got one of those packs there, and uh, it wasn't bad. I pulled a. There we go. Look at that. Not a bad. Not a bad auto. Uh, Sterling Shepard, auto rookie number eighty of ninety nine. So we get our auto in our third pack. Sterling Shepard. Not a bad auto to pull out of this lot, and then uh, Julio Jones next level insert. So there was our auto for this product, and there's a, you know there's always potential for for a bonus. So we'll uh, we'll keep busting through these packs and see what we get. I'm not sure. Like I said, they do these buyback autos, and I'm not sure if they're um, if they're inserted into it or if it's like a box topper type of thing. So maybe there, maybe that's a bonus that's put into the packs. I don't, I don't know. We'll see. We shall see shortly. Well, we may not see because we may not get one. So a glossy series, Joe Theismann, and a glossy series, Jerron Reed. I don't see sequentially number on them or sequential number on them, but as you can see there, right above the name, it says glossy. So I think that's probably the first, probably the first uh, parallel base cards I've seen out of these. Jordan, I figured you were going to buy the Chargers in this one uh, after you were looking at some of the checklists and stuff. So, oh, we have a, uh, we have a, not sure. <laughs> I don't know why they would put a spacer in here, but we did get a Patriots. Team Tributes, 2014, Brady, Gronk, Edelman, and LaFell, quad, no relics, no autos, nothing, but uh, interesting little quad card, and a spacer in here, I'm not really sure why, Eddie, Lacey, Glossy, uh, maybe there's relic cards in some of the packs, and they put the spacers in there as uh, to throw people off that do the that like to do the pack searching, I don't know, I haven't opened up enough to this product to... Uh, to, uh, to know for any certainty. And we get another... We get a Dan Marino Classic Moments. Again, not numbered. 
like I said, I'm just kind of flying through these because I know that there's not really any hits in here. So after we got the uh, the autograph out of the way already, Sterling Shepard, like I said, not a bad auto to pull. Anybody that uh, winds up on the opposite side of Odell Beckham Jr. is bound to see something decent. Jay Cutler, Aaron Rodgers, duel, not a hit. Future legend, Todd Gurley, Monday Night Heroes, Rogers. Yeah, so, like I said, they're just kind of basic, cheaper stuff. I don't I don't want to set up a case break of this or anything, or any group breaks, because at one auto per box, not really, uh, not really something I try to get people to jump into. Okay, so here is a parallel, finally, uh, that is numbered. Timeless Tributes. Numbered out of 99, Kenny Britt. So as you can see along the bottom there, it says Timeless Tributes, where it said Glossy on one of the other parallels before. And then a Ronnie Lott, interceptions and a postseason interceptions record leader. All right, so that's what a that's what the parallel base cards look like now. But like I said, I I wouldn't set up a group break of this just because there's one autograph per box. Um, the odds just aren't there for people. Classic moment, Herm Edwards, DeAndre Hopkins next level. And uh, I prefer to set up case breaks that there's a lot more potential and you, uh, you have a better, a better opportunity for paying off the spot. Glossy Richard Higgins. Seeing, from what I've seen, I haven't even seen any top tier base rookie cards come out of here so far in this in this box so not exactly a product that I'm gonna do a lot of promoting but if anybody wants to buy a box or two they're more than welcome now as I as I say that I'm gonna end up pulling like a one of one Dak Prescott base card or something or Ezekiel Elliott one on one after I said oh there's no rookie no decent rookies in here future legend David Johnson insert Antonio Gates record card yeah nothing okay so that was uh that was one box of 2016 Panini Classics with the Sterling Shepard autograph card being our sole auto that showed up in this product.